Hi guys, and welcome back to, you know what it is, you've always known what this is. Talvin what? Talvin talks, and whilst I'm in somewhere different, you recognise the voice, you know who this is. And um, I wanted to do things a bit differently today, I wanted to be a bit more free without planning. Um, just to say, you know, I've noticed a shift in a lot of people in the way of everyone's trying to get on their grind right everyone everyone wants to feel that they're doing more for themselves everyone wants to start feeling validated within themselves everyone seems to be doing the right things now you must understand that when you have change it overlaps and there is an in between where it overlaps sort of like for example if you're trying to stop smoking and you want you're a smoker you want to be a non-smoker you can't just change to one and get rid of the other it sort of overlaps and whilst it's overlapping for the one to take over you have the in between so you have moments where you will you will still smoke and moments where you won't but the ultimate goal is to not smoke okay and having that being said with that is it an analogy could be totally wrong i need to start reading my dictionaries a bit more um, well, no, basically, so then, just like in life, when you're realising that you want confidence, you want to be strong, you want to be the person you want to be, and all these things, you could be in the middle of a relationship that's not working out so great, and you could end up being a nasty person. Given that, when you do things at first, they are in extreme until you settle for a nice balance, as I told you, alongside the overlapping. But please be considerate of everyone else, because when you were in a low place... When you had things happen to you that you didn't enjoy going on and nobody could hear you, you should remember that as a reason not to make anyone else feel ostracized or make situations worse and then play victim because it hasn't turned out the way you needed. That means because you're not ready. Now, nothing really changes. It only ever um, merges. Like a caterpillar, it starts that way and turns into a beautiful butterfly or a dark moth. Depends on which way you go. But the, in between that change, um, you just have to be kind to yourself and not push yourself too hard. Um, now, in all that to say, I wanted to um, see say that there's a lot of people that are getting very arrogant, I would say. And don't get it twisted, I know if I, I know I've posted enough times with my top half. I think most of my posts of the last few months have been my top off. When I'm trying not to do that now, I must say that I'm trying not to do that because there are people who don't have particular physiques. There are people who feel a certain ways about themselves anyway, and I'm sure I'm not helping. And then you see people posting random crap. I went to the dentist today, but they're showing their whole body naked because they're feeling good about themselves. It's a bit obvious and a bit desperate. And I've fallen into that category, don't get it wrong, but I want to challenge myself a bit because as an artist, I can definitely put things across in a sensual way or in a way that will boost me and give confidence, which I like, to other people without bearing it all. Because at the end of the day, I do want love. I do want someone to love me and I don't think a partner of mine would want to see all that. <laughs> Though I'm sure a lot of you guys do and I do get the messages and I do appreciate that some of you get enjoyment out of my sensual side but what am I keeping for myself now I'm as raw as it is you know I'm trying with bare minimum and I get distracted with thinking I want this I want this in the third and when I really evaluate what I want it can only be what everyone else has got because I have everything I need already for a start I have life God above me people I love you know, I do have money, I do have food, I have ways to live and a means to get about. So, what is my problem? Also, creatively, things are taking a different journey where I can express myself, I feel selfishly, and then still give to other people through my expression and my art pieces and my works. Um, what more do I want? What more do you want? Now, I'm going to say something else as well because... It kind of ticks me off a little bit. I have not been consistent with um, a lot of things when it comes to other people so much anymore in my personal life because 
I really have had to find moments and times to make sure I'm protecting my energy, my aura. All these things we speak about, but we don't do. I'm really doing it and doing the work. That's why I'm demonstrating to you guys how to do it. Um, and so if I make plans, I should be able to cancel them. If I haven't made plans, um, I shouldn't pressure myself to. Um, I'm only doing what I need to do for me because I'm the one who uses these every day. I move this and this left and right to get me places. Do you know, this mouth, I have to take care of it too. <laughs> I have to take care of it too because I need to talk. I need to keep myself good. How else can I help anyone else unless I'm doing that? I'm the foundation. With having that to say, I'm happy to compromise. But I'm learning, while I have 2p, I won't give someone 2p. I'll give them one pence. And that's about it. I'll still share, still do. But I can't compromise myself anymore. All that to say, please don't be offended if people are trying to do what they have to do. If and given that they don't make you feel it's because of you and they explain. Give people a chance to demonstrate who they are. Once you know who they are, accept it and treat it accordingly. Stop complaining. And enjoy the moment. I promise you, I ha I'll have days where I don't want to get out of bed. And I do that, then bounce back with all my energy and joy. Now, in those dark days, they're still my days. I still have to take notion that that is the moment because just like I say tomorrow hasn't come and yesterday's gone in those moments it's the same notion but I'm there with the burden of overwhelm, pain, insecurity all these things and regardless of my prayer and therapy I have a choice to consider what I want out of the day and I'm lucky enough to have a choice right so um, I want to say to you appreciate what you have around you Use your creative brain to make things at least picture perfect of what they can be. And the potential may be of what they should be. But don't make things what they can't be. And especially right now, you can only drive yourself crazy. I'm telling you all this because this is something I tell myself and I am going through it. And it's nothing that I haven't been through before. It's nothing that um, I don't think I will get through. I won't get through. But I'm choosing to be happy. It is a choice. And I've collected the right tools around me to do that. And what others can't do, I will do. And what I can't do, what I can't do, I'll give myself a chance to attempt to. And then I'll move on. And you lo and behold, things come in your direction that make you feel good that you didn't know would make you feel good. Things come in your direction that make you feel bad that you didn't know were bad for you. It's all figuring it out, but you have to know. So get to know you. All right. It doesn't matter what you look like, who you are, whether sitting in a chair, standing up, big, slim, black, white, all the colors in between, just all those notions. You are you. You are an individual. You're experiencing this life. And you're allowed to. So have fun and enjoy doing it. Mwah. Welcome back to Talvin. What? And there'll be more coming along. By the way, I'm just being creative outside of this. I'm just feeding you what I'm going through. So whilst I'm not always here with the Talvin talks, you're still getting what's needed. Take heed, take direction and do what's good for you. It's about you. And allow people to make things about them. We all can be the we, me, I am, alls. <laughs> Love you. Mwah.